This is our 15th annual L'Chaim 5K run for Israel, and uh, we're very thrilled. We've, this is actually, as of this year, we've raised a million dollars um, over all the years for Israel, and uh, it goes to humanitarian needs. Uh, we take care of people who are terrorist victims, Rasmus uh, security needs for settlements which are outlying. We've been helping communities which are evacuees of Gush Katif and Nates Ariel and in, uh, in, 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 in Lachish. We have hundreds of people coming every year to run to support Israel. This particular year, we're raising money for an ambu cycle for United Hatzalah, which of course enables uh, United Hatzalah members to come quickly through the streets and through the highways to take, God, God forbid, uh, terrorist victims, to help them immediately if necessary. We hope, of course, it's not necessary, but this really enables lives to be saved every single day. And we're pleased that's uh, another big project this year to raise for an ambu cycle. And, uh, of course, all communities we give to, one family fund, which helps terrorist victims, food kitchens all around uh, Israel, and provides for the needy um, different communities in uh, Yushalayim, Beit Ha'ilit, uh, the north, the south, all over. This past year also he we went to uh, the, the southernmost tip where Egypt and, and, uh, and the Gaza Strip and Israel uh, meet, and uh, in Otniel, and uh, we're also helping those communities. Okay, I'm uh, Dr. Ben Obersfeld, uh, Jamaica States. I'm so happy to participate in the L'Chaim 5K run for Israel. We've been doing this for so many years. I want to thank my good friend, uh, Dr. Joseph Frager, who always invites me to participate. Uh, I just want to say that uh, it's a tremendous opportunity to give chizik to the state of Israel. And as, as I was speaking with my friend, Joe Frager, uh, I, I told him that I, ju I just come from the Yeshiva University commencement Wednesday, we had the tremendous privilege to hear the commencement speaker, Robert Kraft, owner of the New England Patriots, who built the uh, Kraft football stadium in Yerushalayim, and how inspirational it was to hear a Jew who's a proud Jew and Ohev Yisrael talk about his first trip to Israel in 1963 when he put on Tolleson to fill in at the King David Hotel, looked out and saw the Kotel and bemoaned the fact that he couldn't actually touch the walls of the Kotel. And when in 1967, when it was liberated, he was so moved, the greatest privilege of his life, he said, was when he touched the stones of the Kotel. So I just want to reiterate how moved I was by Robert Kraft's speech and how moving it is to participate every year in this special 5K run for Israel. And thanks to Joe Frager and all the supporters of this event. Thank you. Anyway, I just want to say that everyone is very, very excited this morning as the 15th year of the L'Chaim 5K run, walk run in Jamaica States, and it's a tremendous moral and physical financial booster for the community, for the wider Queens community. It's very exciting. We have so much, so much energy. So many people are excited to help. We've as it was stated, we've raised over a million dollars now just from the run in the last 15 years, and um, it's it's gone to so many very worthy causes. This year, the extra cause is an ambient cycle to help save lives in Israel, and everyone is very much excited to get the feedback. And hopefully, we'll uh, we don't hopefully Israel won't need our efforts anymore. But we we're very excited to do this every year and. Um, I think the enthusiasm from the run has spilled over to many families in the shul have decided to make Aliyah, and uh, it's, uh, it's, it's gratifying. Even a number of our young men have decided to join the Israeli army and put their lives on the line for, for Israel, and we're just proud of every single one of them. We put their picture up in the hallway so everyone can can understand that this is they're they're doing this for us they're doing this for every single jew in the world and israel is our home and that's where we all should be right now this is the best we can do is to have a run for israel and raise money but we all want to be there our hearts are there and god willing we'll all be there very shortly i'm assemblyman david weprin i'm the assemblyman uh, from this area uh, and I, have, I was a city councilman uh, before that and I also belong to the uh, young Israel of Jamaica States and uh, this is the 15th year we're doing this 5k run uh, in support of Israel 
uh, to help uh, our brothers and si sisters in Eretz Israel. And we started it 15 years ago uh, when Israel was under siege uh, and was having uh, a lot of uh, turmoil and difficulty uh, uh, with their neighbors and with, uh, you know, uh, suicide bombings and uh, other uh, terrorist attacks. And unfortunately, uh, some years are better than other years, but it's still uh, an issue, and uh, we still have to stand there uh, with with Israel in their good times and bad times, uh, and really um, be there to support. And this is a little way uh, that we in uh, the United States, we in Queens, uh, we in Jamaica states can help contribute uh, to support the state of Israel and to support our brothers and sisters uh, who are living in Israel and uh, are constantly uh, under siege from our enemies. Hi, Boker Tov. Uh, I'm Rabbi Avi Block. I'm the assistant rabbi in the Young Israel Jamaica states. And this is Ayala, she's my daughter. And uh, we are here this morning to support Artseinu Akdosha, Eretz Israel, and Medinat Israel and to support our community and our community's general support for Medinat Yisrael. The, the, the uh, Eretz Yisrael and Medinat Yisrael play an integral part in every aspect of what we do here. It is, uh, in, it is in our tefillot, it is in our activism, it is in our, it is in, it is in our philanthropy, it is in every fe feature, every aspect of what we do in our community has Eretz Yisrael and Medinat Yisrael as a part of it. And it's really our zechut, it's our merit to be able to continue that passion and that excitement and that uh, commitment to Medinat Yisrael through the Lechaim 5K as we do every single year. Thank you very much. Todah